Hello and welcome to another Performance Architects How-To. Performance Architects is a business and technology consulting company that helps companies initiate and sustain big changes in their performance management and business intelligence environments and process. This video along with others on our channel should help provide some additional insight as you embark on or continue along your EPM and BI journey. Head over to our channel after this video or come back in the future to learn best practices, hear overviews, and take part in lessons we have designed to help you. We are focused on continuing to develop this community and we welcome any recommendations you might have for future content. Thanks and enjoy. Hello and welcome to another Performance Architects How-To. My name is Joe and in this how-to we will discuss the five reasons to consider using HFM to automate cash flow statements. Our outline today, to start off, we will get into what is a cash flow statement. Next, we'll take a look at the three components of a cash flow statement. Then we'll talk more specifically about what is Oracle Hyperion Financial Management, or HFM. And then our headliner for today, we'll, we'll actually get into the five reasons to consider using HFM to automate cash flow statements. And lastly, we'll talk a little bit about migrating from Hyperion Enterprise, or HE, to HFM. So what is a cash flow statement? A cash flow statement is a financial report which shows all money coming into a business, so its sources, and all of the money flowing out from a business, its uses. So basically it shows the business's sources and uses of cash and the beginning and ending values for a specific period. Also a cash flow statement complements the income statement and balance sheet which are two other financial reports and since 1987 GAAP or generally accepted accounting principles require all public companies to prepare a cash flow statement. However it's important to note that even if a company is not public the cash flow statement is still a useful uh, tool for tracking a company's financial health it shows movement of money into and out of a business, you'll remember, so it shows the sources and uses of cash, and cash often matters more than profit. So now we're going to talk about the three components of a cash flow statement. A cash flow statement is made up of operations, investing, and financing. Our first activity or component of the cash flow statement is operations. Operations section shows the sources and uses of cash from a company's internal operations. Basically it includes cash earnings plus changes to working capital. So over the medium term this must be net positive if the company is to remain solvent. The second component is investing and this shows the sources and uses of cash from a company's investments. This shows cash received from the sale of long life assets for example buildings or equipment and cash spent on capital expenditures like investments, acquisitions, and other long life assets. The third component is the financing component, and this shows the sources of cash, the uses of cash from a company's issuance of debt or equity. So it shows cash received from the issue of debt and equity, or cash paid out as dividends, or share repurchases, or debt repayments. All right, our next slide is what is Oracle Hyperion Financial Management? HFM is a financial closing consolidation tool. It's a comprehensive web-based application that delivers global and financial consolidation, reporting and analysis in a single, highly scalable software solution. HFM is a part of the Oracle EPM suite, or the Enterprise Performance Management suite. Examples of other applications in this suite are Oracle Hyperion Planning, strategic finance, and performance scorecard. HFM utilizes today's most advanced technology, yet is built to be owned and maintained by the enterprise's finance team. HFM supports global and statutory requirements like GAAP, IFRS, which stands for International Financial Reporting Standards, or local standards. And HFM can also provide the reconciliation or of differences among these various standards. So the crux of this uh, how-to today is the five reasons to consider using HFM to automate cash flow statements. Number one is to reduce the error rate. 
Assuming your cash flow statement is being manually built in a spreadsheet, it is susceptible to human error. Automating your cash flow can help remove this element. HFM will produce reliable and detailed reporting. It will also provide a single version of the truth to support financial management and statutory reporting. HFM will validate the cash flow statement like other financial statements and it will automate the changes and balances from one period to the next. It will pull values from the income statement and roll forwards as well. It will also accurately calculate the effect of the exchange rate on the change in cash. Number two, HFM will provide scalability to support any future acquisitions. As companies grow larger and larger, the more acquisitions, the more cumbersome a manual process will become. HFM is also easy to integrate. It will integrate not only with the other Hyperion products, but also within your existing infrastructure. Number three, HFM will improve productivity. The cash flow process, which includes the creation and even review of statements, can take upwards of two weeks when done manually, depending on the size of the entity or the complexity of the transactions that occur in a specific quarter. HFM will provide a faster close. It will accelerate reporting cycles, thus reducing closing cycles by days, and deliver more timely results to internal and external stakeholders. Number four, perform strategic analysis. You'll spend less time on processing and more time on analysis. Building on our previous point, a faster close will free up time for your employees. Number five, replace spreadsheet approaches and older systems. Manual solutions and older systems lead to increased risk. Spreadsheet-based solutions are difficult to maintain and you're most likely using dozens of worksheets that source one another, so one broken link can be disastrous. Also, older systems might not have the capacity to meet the increasingly demanding reporting requirements of today. One example of an older system might be Hyperion Enterprise or HE. Now we'll talk about migrating from Hyperion Enterprise to Oracle Hyperion Financial Management, so moving from HE to HFM. If you're using HE and are considering replacement, you should seriously consider migrating to HFM. These are similar products, but HFM offers 12 dimensions as opposed to HE's 4, and migrating would help add this dimensionality. Oracle Hyperion Enterprise Extraction Utility can help you migrate an HE application into an HFM application. The utility will help convert metadata along with the full application. This migration works effectively, but you'll need to be in the latest version of HE, which is 6.5.1. It's also also worth mentioning that you'll need to do some cleanup work, and it is advisable to redesign your applications to fully unleash the power of HFM. And also worth mentioning, Oracle Hyperion Enterprise is moving off Premier support in May of 2013, so this means there will be no new updates, fixes, or security alerts with either new third-party products or new Oracle products. In this how-to, you learned the five reasons to consider using HFM to automate cash flow statements. Thank you for joining us today. Please visit our Performance Architects how-to channel for other videos on enterprise performance management and business intelligence solutions.